Hello and welcome to the Outpost RV. My name is Jeremy and today we're going to take a look at the Wolf Pup 16 BHS. This camper comes in at 21 feet 9 inches and weighs right at 3,500 pounds. Up front here you have your tongue jack and it will also flip over. That way you can use a cordless screw gun to run that up and down. We have a 20 pound LP tank bottle that will be filled by the Outpost RV. We have your diamond plate rock guard, curved radius front end here. On the side, we have a magnetic door catch for your storage compartment. Underneath up front, we have an LP quick disconnect. So if you have a portable gas grill, you could take that with you and tap right into it. We also have four manual stabilizer jacks, two in the front and two in the back. Also right in front of that, you'll notice this holographic light of the wolf head emblem shining down, really pops and makes you stand out from the rest. We have a 15 foot power awning here with the blue LED accent light. Each leg is adjustable, that way if the sun's coming down, you can adjust the pitch of the awning. We have your sturdy steps going in where each leg is also adjustable. Oversized grab handle, entrance door with a full size screen door, and there is an integrated window as well. We have your pup kitchen with your mini fridge and prep table here. There is also a black tank flush on this model, so when you're done camping for the week or weekend, hook up your water hose, that'll clean out the tank for you. We have your outside entertainment center with your TV bracket right here and connections. Down below, you'll notice the center cap is popped off. These are the quick, easy lube axles. Both wheels are gonna have self-adjusting brakes and a tire pressure monitoring system. And how that will work, the side of this will turn red if you're low on air. So we'll unscrew that to demonstrate. That way you could just walk around and do a visual inspection before you head off for your next destination. This camper is also equipped with the adventure package, giving you the off-road tire, a two inch lift, and the diamond plate along the bottom here. In the very back, we are pet friendly. We have your leash latch here, so the furry family members can tag along. Spare tires included, four inch tube bumper to store your sewer hose in there. Up top, we have your backup camera. That is included, and then also a ladder prep, so you can buy a telescoping ladder separately and hook it right up there. We have a light on this side right by your dump station and close to the connections. That way if it's nighttime, you can see what's going on. Over here, lots of storage with the bunk bed area. This is gonna be continuous storage underneath. And if you need taller items, you can actually take this bunk bed, lift it up and leave it up permanently and get a much taller storage compartment there. In the front here, this is a 30 amp unit and it will come with a 25 foot detachable power cord. We have an outside shower with hot and cold water. It's got the coil hose sprayer in there. Over here, we have your water fill station. The left side is the fresh water. So if you're dry camping or boondocking, you could turn on your water pump and use that water. You have the city water. So if you're at a campground, you just hook your water hose up right to that and that'll pressurize the lines for you. And last but not least, we have your on-demand water heater. It is a tankless system, gas only, but it's only using gas when you're running hot water. So about 60% more efficient than what we've used in the past. And that'll conclude our outside walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 16 BHS. And now we'll take a look at the inside. As we move to the inside, you'll notice we have another light shining down with the Wolf Pup logo there. We have your front queen bed, dinette area, the corner bunk beds, the bathroom in the back, and your kitchen area here. And we'll go ahead and get started right inside the entrance door. We have your main control panel where you can keep an eye on your holding tanks, turn on the water pump, lights, run your awning in and out. This camper is also equipped with 12 volt heating pads on your holding tanks, so you can turn those on if the weather gets at the freezing temperature outside. Overhead storage, we have your microwave up top with the range vent as well. In the kitchen, we have this huge kitchen window that goes all the way across. Lots of counter space here. We're gonna have storage down below as well. We have your furnace over there to the right. Two burner stove with the glass top. So you can use that as prep space as well. The sink area, we have your high rise faucet. There is a built in soap dispenser. We have the sink cover and this huge single bowl sink as well. Underneath the refrigerator, we're gonna have your breakers and fuses. There is a red key that is a 12 volt cutoff switch that will kill all 12 volt power to the battery. And then we have a CO2 detector. The refrigerator is a 12 volt fridge. There is a 100 watt solar panel already mounted on this camper. 
and that will help run the fridge as you're traveling down the road. These fridges are much deeper than the gas electric style, giving you more storage inside. And now we will go back and take a look at the bathroom. Inside here, straight ahead, we have your toilet. On the wall to the right, we have a thermostat, and that is going to be for your on-demand water heater. So you can turn that on and off and adjust the temperature of it. Up top here, we are going to have a vent that will have a 12-volt vent fan included. We have your shower surround. This is going to come with a rectangle shower. Get the shower head over here. And it also has a built-in sink in the corner. And then, of course, your hot and cold water down below. And there is a large edge on this. Uh, giving you like a mini tub in here as well. And as we take a look on the outside here, you'll notice up on the ceiling, we have a subwoofer back here. There are a couple interior speakers. Your air conditioner is mounted on the ceiling as well. Over here in the bunk beds, each bunk is going to be equipped with its own light and 12 volt charge port. There is a USB and a USB-C charge port here. The top bunk has its own window. And then the bottom bunk is going to be uh, the same setup, except it's gonna have that door up back here. So that way you can utilize that storage underneath it. There is a thermostat right here for your furnace to control that and turn it on and off. On the storage up above, we have your stereo, which is AM, FM and Bluetooth compatible. We have a voltmeter up above that to keep an eye on your batteries. And of course, these two large storage compartments. We have the dinette, which has storage underneath each seat. And the table can also lay flat, giving you another sleeping area here. Up in the bedroom area, we've got windows on both sides. At the head of the bed here, we're going to have two different charge ports. You got the 12 volt charge port on the left hand side. Over on the right, that is a 110 outlet with a built in inverter. So, as you are traveling down the road, even if you're at a rest stop and you are not plugged in, you can turn that outlet on and have 110 power. We had the overhead storage cabinets, queen size mattress. Over here at the foot of the bed, we have your other window. And right up above that, we have your TV connections mounted on the ceiling and the TV bracket on the wall. And that will conclude our walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 16 BHS. I appreciate you guys watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact myself or Henry at 866-338-9845. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.